But first, Texas A&M is coming to Israel. Good evening and thank you for joining us. I'm Matthew LeBlanc. Amanda Kenny will join you tonight at 10. Governor Perry and A&M System Chancellor John Sharp announced the university's plans to open Texas A&M University at Nazareth Peace Campus. They made the announcement today in Israel at the Israeli president's home, something that's been in the works for years. We join KAG's HD News reporter Jenny Walsh in the studio with our top story. Jenny, you got the perspective today of a local rabbi. Matthew, the rabbi of the Ror Habad Jewish Center, believes this is a great move for Texas A&M. He and a lot of other students, faculty and staff feel this opens up the doors for students all over the world to take advantage of the academics Israel offers. The faculty and student body will be a mix of Arab, Jewish and international students. Once it's up and running, the campus will offer a variety of majors and degrees with one common goal of working together for education. They both could be able to uh, share with each other and be able to advance um, technologies and work together and uh, helping both, both places, Israel, and as well as being able to help the state of Texas. The state of Israel and the state of Texas share a deep respect for our cultures and this university will be a permanent reminder of the power of education. The university will build the branch in Nazareth, paid for just by donations. Tonight at 10, hear from Texas A&M Jewish students about what they think of the new branch. Matthew.